Hi, my name is James. James loves games. Welcome, folks. The jankiness is no more. Uh, so yeah, I've been having some network problems uh, as far as the streaming goes, which is part of the reason I wanted to take a break because it was very frustrating to have to wrestle with all those issues. But I figured them out. Apparently, uh, my virtual network adapter or whatever thing. Something in the computer. My computer pipes got clogged with information. So that's that's what that was. Got it. Got it all cleared up, and we should be smooth sailing all night, just in time for this like 420p, like low res. Who cares if it's lagging? Kind of PlayStation 2 game. <laughs> so, <laughs> well, hallelujah, <laughs> we got it fixed. Too busy trying to hack the CIA, right, James? Yeah, you know, I'm capable of that. Uh, I think if you've, this is all just a ruse, this sort of dopey, don't know much about anything character persona that I've created for you guys. It's all a ruse. I'm actually a, a top secret spy. Um, so yeah, but anyway, it's good to see a lot of you guys. Haven't seen you in a while. Uh, Shane, Dwayne, Nicole, and Nasen. Uh Nicole asked, are you going to play Forspoken? I wasn't planning on it. I played the demo and was really not impressed. I don't know. Just seemed kind of just seemed kind of meh. But uh, that could change. I'll wait for the reviews. I, I know they updated it and made some changes after the demo went out. But uh, it just seemed kind of generic. It didn't really do anything new. And it just, I didn't like the way it controlled. So, you know, whatever. I've got enough on my plate. Seriously. I'm digging into <laughs> like Silent Hill 2. So this is, this is where I'm at. Uh, but no plans to stream it as of this time, as of this time, but if it becomes free on like PS plus or something later, uh, I'll probably give it a go just for posterity's sake. Anyway. Uh, so yeah, tonight we're doing, uh, Silent Hill 2. I've, uh, hold on. Fair warning. Okay. Let me switch over to the, uh, the Silent Hill screen, uh, the PlayStation 2 screen. I am working with some ancient, ancient technology. This is a this is the original hardware with a disc. And so it's like the connection from the PS2. This is a launch. This is a launch day PS2. This isn't like a slim or a DX or an S plus or anything, whatever. It's like I got this on the day in September of 2000. Um, and I keep looking at it, hoping it doesn't catch on fire. Uh, and it's hooked up to all these cables that go through my ancient uh, Elgato capture card that I have to use because the PS2 doesn't have an HDMI cable. And then, uh, yeah, it's just, it's pretty finicky. So if you start hearing buzzing and the screen flickers, it's just because the connector just decided to be in a bad mood. So there you go. Uh, disclaimer out of the way. Um, Nasen, the demo was a bit so-so. Had it been set to Japanese voiceover, couldn't stand to have the cringy dialogue. I didn't James even really... Honey, did something happen to you? Yeah, After I wasn't streaming for a while and i know i'm sorry so yeah the protagonist name is also james so that works out beautifully but anyway uh i i wanted to play silent hill 2 because i have it and i have the actual disc for some reason and uh, i never actually beat this game i played it back in the day uh just a little bit at a friend's house and uh Figured I should beat it before the remake comes out so I can really appreciate all of the changes or just rip it shreds because it's not as good as the original. But either way, that's my choice. So it should be fun. Uh, yeah. Nolik Alwyn, Silent Hill 2 is still one of the better horror games ever made. Can't wait for the remake. Same, same. Ancient tech. Yes, Nicole. It's probably, this PlayStation is probably older than some of you. <laughs> so, <laughs> but I don't know. I attract kind of an older, older audience like myself. So yeah. Um, the good old days of memory cards. Yep, when you had a button where you could turn the the analog sticks on and off, isn't that fun and totally necessary? Okay, sorry, babe. All right. Anyway, I couldn't find a release date for the remake. There is not a release date out yet, but speculation is that it will be summer of this year. At least that's what I've heard. For I think Silent Hill. What was it? Silent Hill F and Silent Hill 2 Remake are supposed to be coming out around the same time, like summer, June-ish, I think. So yeah, let's go to the options, because uh, for whatever reason, the screen 
position. I was playing with this earlier, and the screen position is a little bit uh, is a little bit off. Which it's crazy that they even put this kind of option in here. I think. Bob, you gotta love those old school Konami sound effects too. Um, vibration. You can pick different languages. Oh wow! I can play in Japanese if I want. Uh, I won't, <laughs> but I could. All right, that's good. Whatever happened to RE4 Remake? March 24th, I think. Yes, March 24th, Nicole, is Resident Evil 2, or Resident Evil 4 Remake, and I am super pumped about that one. Uh, no, like, it wouldn't surprise me if it got pushed to 2023 holiday into early 2024, but I'm hoping summer. Summer would be great. I think it'd be a great summer game. I just want to play it six months earlier. So, uh, action level, we'll do normal, because I'm normal. Riddle level, also normal, uh, which is funny that they have two different difficulty levels. Maybe it's like, I'm terrible at combat, but I love puzzles. Whatever. I'll just do normal. Nicole, I'm 31. That's okay. I, like I said, I, I think most of the people are uh, old like me, <laughs> but you never know. Some, some young kids might wander into the stream accidentally. Got a, I had a pimple, so I had to check it out. Here we go again. I love this urinal cam. Oh, he's in a bathroom. I see. It's a bathroom. Thirty-six. How old is old? <laughs> I'm thirty-eight, so we're all we're all kindred spirits here. Um, Mary, could you I really be in this town? You know, my channel isn't like uh, PewDiePie or Markiplier or whatever, where the average viewer is probably 12 years old. So, <laughs> Dwayne, I'm 35 on Tuesday. Oh, cool. Happy birthday, Dwayne, if I don't get the chance to say it again. Look at us. Nasin, I'm 45. I'm not old or an old woman. Old woman. Wait, am I the youngest? I think you are, Last Olympian. By the way, footstep load screen, it's great. James looks like he just took some edibles and then they kicked in while he was in the bathroom. Whoa. This fog is like foggy, man. In my restless dreams, I see that town. Silent Hill. What's up, Bones? Over 9, you promised you'd take me there again someday. But you never did. <laughs> Grudge well, much? I'm alone there now. <laughs> in our special place. <laughs> I like I'm how she put... For you. <laughs> she puts special place in quotes. Like, you thought it was special, so I'm going to say it's the special place. I what got a letter. The name on the envelope said, Mary. Mary. But I'm not name. Mary, so I threw it in the trash. It's ridiculous. Couldn't possibly be true. That's what I keep telling myself. A dead person can't write a letter. Yet. Mary died of that damn disease three years ago. That rascally disease. So then, why am I looking for her? Our special place. I can't find the key to our safety deposit be? box. This whole town was our special place. Does she mean the park on the lake? We spent the whole day there. Just the two of us. I thought this was a scary game. Staring Could at the Mary water. Could really be there? Could Mary really be there? Is she really alive? Waiting for me? Do you really want her to be? She sounds kind of passive aggressive with that letter. You promised you would take me there, but, uh, you know, I'm there now, alone, in our special place. Way to go. 
Husband of the year here, James. All right, I can actually play. Um, we may be old, but not mature. Oh, age is just a number. It's not an indicator of maturity. Age is just how many times the Earth has gone around the sun. It's totally arbitrary. I like how when I'm running and then stop, he slides a little bit like this is a Mario ice level. Oh, he didn't do it there. He didn't do it there either. Am I lying? Yeah, he slides a little bit. Now, is it Toluca Lake or does that say Toluca Lake? I'm confused. What's in the van? Jack Moore, what's up, man? Good to see ya. It's over here. By the way, uh, whoa, I can't go any further by car. I guess I'll have to walk. We come I. Or is that an exclamation point? We come Paleville. Huh. Okay. This has the uh, the really awful late 90s, early 2000s survival horror control scheme where if you're unfamiliar, it's like you turn around by pushing left or right and then walk forward from the character's perspective by pressing up. It's horribly atrocious and uh, I'm gonna have to get used to it. That was one of the great things about the uh, Resident Evil remakes. Wait, is there anything in my car? Let me check it out. This game did not age well. No. <laughs> it's like I said, it's 420p. That's the only time you don't want to hear 420, am I right? I got a map of Silent Hill. Well, that's I'm glad I checked. It was in your car and you just left it with the door open? Or is that not your car? Surely that's his car. He is stoned. He totally is. He got stoned and parked in four parking spaces, went to the bathroom and stared at his face for two hours, and then reread his wife's letter until it drove him insane. Let's check out this map. That was a good map sound. I like a good map sound in a game when you open it up. Oh, it is Toluca Lake. Sanford Street. Well, this is a tiny. It's all water. Oh, wait, where am I? Am I at Rosewater Park? This park is terrible. I don't miss these graphics. feel like I'm not wearing my glasses. <laughs> yeah, the sketchy white van really sets the tone. Let's see what's over this way. When do I find a gun? This is the road I came in on. There's no point in going back. What about the horse I rode in on? How about that? Been busy with work. Currently on my way to New Jersey. Oh. Say hi to the fine people of New Jersey for me. <laughs> I know how much you love New Jersey, Jack. <laughs> drink my sugar water. Foggy! Oh, and the camera doesn't let me see what's actually in front of me. Oh yeah, I've also got this sweet... Oh, what the heck? To the left, to the left, to the right, to the right. Little strafe action. Not a fan of that sound. Creepy fog dogs. Where the fog am I going? <laughs> oh, he actually got tired. Tired of my nonsense. Back when games just sort of leaned into not having any 
you know, draw distance. They're like, you can't see more than 20 feet away. Just say it's fog. It's great. Something in the well. It's not like the movie at all. No. What the fuck? What's that? Looking at this makes me feel like someone's groping around inside my skull. Yeah, again, it's the edibles. It gives me... <laughs> There's not even a well. There's not even a town. He's in his bathroom, tripping. He's in the bathtub right now. Oh. Ugh. The save this memory card's in my brain. Bop. Well, well, well. <laughs> well. <laughs> Forest. You sound like Mikel Arteta. We've got to get out of this fogging place. Come on, James. Pull it together. Oh, cool. Is this part of the park? This is a weird park. This is this is a PS2 actually last lamp. I forgot my Yeah, 2001. Excuse me. I... <gasps> oh, I I'm sorry. I I no, was it's just... okay. I didn't mean to scare you. I'm kind of lost. <laughs> lost? <laughs> Looking for Silent Hill? Is this the right way? Um, yeah. It's hard to see with this fog, but there's only the one road. You can't miss it. How Thanks. are you lost? This whole town is a straight but, line. Yes? I think you'd better stay away. This, uh... Th this town, there's something wrong with it. It's because you're hard here? To explain, but <laughs> Is it dangerous? Maybe. And it's not just the fog either. Okay, it's... I got it. I'll be careful. Right, something potentially dangerous. No. Whatever. Lady. I believe you. It's just I guess I really don't care if it's dangerous or not. I'm going to town either way. You see, since my wife left. But why? I've been very depressed. I'm looking for someone. You. Who, who is it? Someone very important to me. I'd do anything if I could be with her again. Think hard. Me too. Someone. I'm looking for what was her my name mama. again. I, I mean, mama? my mother. It's been so long since this I've is seen a train her. wreck. <laughs> I thought my father and brother were here, but I can't find them either. Well, hon, you're in a graveyard. Uh, I'm sorry. So unless they're dead, it's not your no, problem. I, you're probably I not here. I hope you find them. Yeah, you too. They said they were going grocery shopping, but I thought I'd check the graveyard first. I'm not sure why. It's this town. It's so weird. Nicole, is it just me or does this acting feel a little forced? A little forced? This is like aliens reading the script. The director's getting so frustrated. No, more human. Do it more human. This town is something weird happening. I'm convinced this isn't fog and it's actually pot smoke. There's like a big music festival going on in town. And so everybody's just stoned out of their gourd. That's what it is. Is this where I came from? I think it is. Oh yeah, I can do the the quick turn. <laughs> Acting by AI. <laughs> Friends and family of the writers. Probably. 
Let's see, I don't know anybody. Maybe I'll call up my childhood piano teacher and see if she'll reprise the role of distraught lady in Graveyard. They got barbed wire around the graveyard? Are they keeping people out or keeping people out? Ah. At least in Resident Evil, the camera was stationary, so you could navigate more consistently. This, like, moving camera forces you to adapt to its oddness. Silent Hill Ranch. Got any Silent Hill Italian? I'm on a diet. This feels like watching a movie as a kid, then rewatching it years later and realizing you were an idiot. <laughs> Sometimes it's best to just enjoy those memories and not, not dive back in to that precious thing you remember. <laughs> But, you know, I only played it a little bit, so this isn't really a nostalgic romp down memory lane for me. I don't remember any of this. So does my position actually change on the map or is it just a stationary map? Oh, that's where I was, the observation deck. Okay, so this place is rather large. Rosewater Park is the destination. Put your cardio in. Seriously, is this the only way into town? You have to walk through the graveyard? <clears throat> Rusty that gate. It's like Big League Chew for the first time since you were a kid. Just don't do it and enjoy the one that used to taste good. <laughs> or like Gushers, that candy Gushers. If you ever had Gushers as an adult, they're pretty disgusting. I don't know why I would get so excited for those. Like it tastes like it was made in a factory for sure. It's the most artificial thing person could eat. Talk about a walking simulator. Jeez. Now I gotta be careful too because uh, there's no auto saves as far as I know. Gushers pop a zit in your mouth. Yeah, pretty much. Hmm. Fruit flavored cysts. <laughs> so far the soundtrack is the scariest thing <sighs> tired y'all oh yeah let's look at this <laughs> use the picture Photo of Mary. A photo from when she was still healthy. All right. Letter from Mary. My restless dreams to see that town, Silent Hill. You promised you'd take me there again someday, but you never did. I'm alone there now, waiting for you. <laughs> Mary, we've been over this. Even from the grave, she's nagging him. Okay. Oh, I didn't even look at the map. That's why I opened this. Ah, reading this dumb letter again. Oh, okay. What a pleasant river. Cafe Texan. The place where you throw peanut shells on the floor. 
Come on, James. Shouldn't have skimped on your cardio. Alright, all you young whippersnappers. Quiz time. What is this thing? Alright. It's hard to play a new game because you don't know like what you can interact with. Especially since everything just blends into the background pretty well. Nah, no, I'm at work now and I'm annoyed that we already sold out of the white chocolate cream eggs. Sooner. I mean. <laughs> yeah, you know, Easter candy in January. Gotta. Gotta get a jump on it. Wait, can I go in this creepy white van? The percentage of creepy white vans in this town is alarmingly high. <laughs> I know what it is. It's something mobsters beat people up with on the street. Are these marks blood? Most certainly. But doom 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 doom. But doom 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 doom. Out to get you. Another creepy white van, man. Let's follow this trail of blood. Could be someone's having car problems. Let's help them. Oh, more blood. Ooh, the blood leads into this alley. Let's investigate. Look at that. Is that a ping pong table? Awesome. Oh. Yes. Glad you're back. Money for seafood. <laughs> Thanks, Les Olympian. I love me some smoked salmon. They put a parking lot on a piece of land Where the silent hill used to stand This, is a, this isn't a parking lot. What kind of parking lot is this? There's a gate. In a curb. <laughs> the world's worst parking lot. You could... <laughs> how to tell if your game was developed by Japanese people. <laughs> this is a parking lot. Yeah, we could fit 20 cars in there. No American would ever say they could fit a car in this place. Let's do some all. Dr. Respect, thanks for the sub. Can I actually move the camera? What the heck? Kind of? If I push L2? That's weird. Where the deuce am I? I'm ready for Silent Hill 2 remake. What about you? Heck yeah. Just playing through this one to uh, appreciate it more when it comes out. Yeah, we'll see where this goes. I bet there's something over here. He'll never go back to sea. I might. Someday. Another white van. Either people in this town eat an inordinate amount of ice cream or something fishy's going on. This looks like it's open for customers. Oh geez, there's something in there. What is that thing? James. 
Look at the thing. Oh, this is bad. And capital B. Oh man, been hitting the gym. Those glutes. Those glutes don't quit. Silent Hill is known for its high quality. Ah, how do I fight? <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> I don't know how to fight. <laughs> Let me look at the controls. I didn't think this would come up. Options. Type? Oh, button config. There we go. Oh, thank goodness. It's like, is this one of those things they only put in the manual? Um, okay, so I can guard with square. Aim with R2. Aim with R2? That's weird. Just X, I guess? No, didn't mean to do that. No, don't change the settings. Bob. You did say something about the fog being pot smoke, so maybe that's the reason for all the sketchy wife. <laughs> yeah, they're all DEA agents. Just waiting. All right, we'll try this. Ouch! Stink! There we go. What the hell is it? It's not human. Neither are you, so... Cool. And traumatizing. Let's hang about. Now, when I see that, okay, I'm like, I'll just download Tinder or something and move on with my life. Mystery solved. Oh, yeah. This thing broken? The subtitles really help. What the jam? You're out of jam? I better take it anyway. I might need it. I might need to listen to this lady's shopping list. Cool beans. All right. Oh, yeah. There's a quick button. I think L1 was... Nope. That's... Da -da. Triangle. Triangle's the map. Nice. Okay, so I can't go that way. I don't think so. Why is it on the map if I can't go that way? You go this way? This is where you just spam the X button and hope that you can get through somewhere. All right, I can't. Had to confirm. I'm just watching this in my dark living room. I'm finding myself laughing more than being scared. Yeah, me too. You know, after playing Visage, this is just kind of a, this is like a caricature of a horror game. It's like a parody, almost. All right, watch out, world. I got a stick. I know how to use it. Save at the ping pong table. The ping pong parking lot. Yes. There's something very satisfying and nostalgic about that noise. Bob. Bop. Found it recently that when I had a random firework at night throughout the year, it's the dealers letting people know the uh, <laughs> merchandise is available. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> I'm sure that won't uh, 
come back to, you know, backfire, blow up in their face, so to speak. Go in there. No. I hear footsteps. Footsteps, footsteps. Ah! No! What, you wanna go, bro? Do this all day, son. I probably have to. Oh, gross! What the heck? This is... This is an unexpected development. What the heck? Fossil, dude, you look like a math teacher. Are you a teacher? I was a teacher at some point. I was an English teacher for about two years. I would be the worst math. Oh, the worst. I would be the worst math. <laughs> the worst math teacher. See, I teach English. I speak it so well. Okay, let's. Dang it, I keep forgetting to hit a triangle for the map. Okay, so that road's blocked. Cafe Texan, Let's see what they got in there. In your absence, I watched you play Sekiro and I kind of played along with you. I beat it, but to get the plat, you have to replay the game and after beating each scene, I don't wanna. You were a beast at that game. <laughs> It was fun, but I kind of feel the same way. It's one of those things that if there's a dry spell where there's no new games coming out that I want to play for several months, I might go back and try to get the Platinum in Sekiro. But it's just... I got my... I got my satisfaction from that game, so... I don't feel it's necessary. So I prefer the just walking zombies than the crawling, the creepy crawly ones. What's up, man? So I might change my tune. I can't go in there. Pardon. Now we're gonna, oh. What is it, boy? Is there a save point, boy? What are you looking at? I got a health drink. Well, that's nice that he actually looks. Give you a little hint. Something is amiss. Something is afoot. It was definitely worth playing for myself instead of just watching. Oh man, Sekiro is one of the best. It really is. And I appreciated it a lot more after watching uh, Vati Vidya's lore videos. The game is actually surprisingly sad, uh, but very, very, very good. As with all FromSoft games, I would have preferred they, you know, tell me what the story is, but it's nice to have somebody like him who can explain it to us. The apartment gate key. Okay. I think she's dead. Wait, can I check the trash cans? Can I rummage through these people's garbage like a uh, walking raccoon? James the raccoon. Sekiro is definitely the... Oh, ah, get out of here. You... <laughs> Not cool, man. <laughs> all right, all right. We're knocking stuff out. I think I'm going to go down Lindsay Street. All the way. Oh, wait, now that's where I started. Yeah. I don't know if I went all the way down Lindsay Street. I'll go down to Sanders and then make a make a east. It's like having to navigate this like some tourist. Oh, what now? Hey, buddy, don't spit on me. The locals are crazy. What is this, New Orleans? Freaky people walking down the street throwing up on me. Wait, is it? Sounds friendly. It 
sounds whimsical. There we go. What are you looking at? Oh, there is a bottle. James knows a thing or two about finding a bottle. You can't get the Shura ending very quickly. Oh, geez. Red light district. Pulling the right way. Yes. Ah, oh, they were all at Gonzalez Mexican restaurant. That's why they're all throwing up. Heard bad things about that place. I don't think those cooks wash their hands. Oh, jeez. What's this? All right. Another dead end. What is that? Zebra crossing? Excuse me, sir. I'm looking for a Rosewater Park. Just follow the blood. That's where all the cool people are. All right, so I want to make... I want to go left over to Happy Burger. All right, let me make sure I'm going the right way. This town is difficult to navigate. At least they don't chase you to the ends of the earth, like a lot of games. You know, they kind of have a good spew at you and then just say, ah, whatever. I learned him. Happy Burger! Ooh, what we got? I got a first aid kit. I got some garbage I found in the parking lot. Close, man. Oh, my happy set. Walked all this way. Alright, where the heck am I? Oh, Saul Street. Saul, good man. Dog food sandwich. Gross, Dwayne. I don't know if I watched The Walking Dead enough to get to that point. I think I made it through, like, season four of that show? Ooh, let's go camp. Excuse me. Let's go camping, guys. It's contagious. I'm going to start throwing up on everybody. Yay! Now what is this, uh, an apartment? Motorhome, accurate. It's in season, ah, oh, that's okay, Dwayne. I was not planning on, I'll wait at Bar Neely's. You can just call it Neely's? Bar Neely's? It's Neely's Bar. Well, whoever that person is, let's go meet them and see if some unfortunate fate has befallen them. Wait, National Donut Day? Why is it the first time hearing that info? National Donut Day? Mmm. Uh, Nasen. I followed Fighting Cowboy 100% playthrough, got all endings in one play, then just had to go to the halfway point in New Game Plus 2. Yeah. I I did the whole, like, cloud save sort of deal as well. But it's just some of those bosses. Even the Shura ending. Like, I, I've had more trouble fighting Ishin in the Shura ending than, like, Sword Saint Ishin at the end of the game. Like, it was crazy. I just, I lost my mojo or something. 
I still can't believe I beat Ishin as quickly as I did. I'm convinced it was a fluke. Or some horrible prank, and I didn't actually beat him. Neelys! Something... Something sounds, though, creepy. So people paid money for this game? Dude, it was 2001. What are you... People were watching the Tom Green show. Anything was entertainment back then. There's, there was a hole here. It's gone now. All right. Good. Nasan, before you fight Owl, backup save and choose sure ending, then reload to full ending, then you have to sure again. Yeah, it's a, it's a whole thing. Uh, ooh. What's this? Huh. Okay. So if I go reverse up that arrow, I can probably get to something. Something good. Oh, nice. What a, what a friendly, considerate game that it just marks it on my map for me. Back in 2001, no less. Good old load times. Let me just check my map here in the middle of the street. Don't mind me. Ah! Hawk is broken. Are you kidding me? Aha! Aw, uh, dude, you can fit through that. You're not so big. Woohoo! I'm so glad I got that apartment key. No trespassing. Wait, why is there a barbed wire fence all the way around this apartment building? Does not bode well. Oh, sweet garbage. No use for that. Beg to differ, but whatever. This James thinks he's too good for garbage. <sighs> Gotta love this apartment block music. about that stream y'all zero dropped frames <gasps> sweet nectar <laughs> health drink yeah i got a health drink too it boosts my vitality or some other such nonsense they would say back in like the 1890s The new syrup drink that'll give you vigor. That's an apartment complex. I've seen restricted areas that look more inviting. It's, uh, you know, it's not the best. This looks like it's straight out of Verdant from Call of Duty Warzone.
I'm glad I'm inside now and it's harder to run from monsters. Look at these responsible people locking their doors. I think they are. The controls are just slightly better than Resident Evil's. Oh, what's up? Oh! Fine, I'll go this way. By the way, what's... How am I able to see in this place? Bones, you're right. This game does have pretty quick load times for a PS2 game. Ooh. Nope. Nope. Hard pass. Hard pass on that one. I appreciate the flashlight, but, uh... Let's see what horrors await in this apartment. Stick it to him. Stop that. How come I can't hit him? Is that just for creepiness factor, or...? There's nothing to do here? Uh, again. I think there's business to be done. Wait, I think I saw something. Ooh! Handgun bullets! Ah, oh, jeez! Ah! Ooh, she's all legs! Ah! Ah, ah, ah. Please tell me there's a gun in here somewhere. Dual shock too, not connected. Oh, hey, that is. Fire. Play me like that. There's just nothing in here. Is that what me? Just some bullets. Alright, I'll take some bullets. No, stop it! Oh, okay. If I hold down X, he smashes down on it. Well, that's good to know. This is so entertaining. I'm glad. No spitting. Where's my money? This landlord is just so done with it. That works. Ah! Lily, 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 legs, lily, lily. Leggy blonde, goodbye, goodbye. Can you, there you go. Someone's sneaking up on me right now. I don't like it. Yep. Ow! Oh, gross. This generation, I swear. Throwing up on me. Oh, I see. So the little uh, radio thing acts up when there's monsters around. Gotcha. Where's the money, Lebowski? Oh, well, golly. I'm glad I came down this traumatizing hallway for nothing. Wait a minute. 
No, that was too easy. <laughs> what do you mean, leaky toilet? Here, let me teach you how to fix that air conditioner yourself. I can't get the door open. I like how it doesn't say it's locked. It's like he just put lotion on his hands and the doorknob's all slippery. I can't get it open. It's so frustrating. All right, let's see about Lily Legs in here. What's up? They're really not so bad. It's a good thing I'm a leg nigga. Okay, calm down, buddy. Did you get it? Okay. Ew, it's leaking. What's this? Nothing? Seriously? Why do these apartments not have windows? That, to me, is kind of the most disturbing part. A thing of use? What's even the point of this room? Is this just a room to scare you and introduce you to this new enemy? Oh, that's right. I got the flashlight. That's right. Duh. Love a good Mel Brooks reference, right? Jeez. These enemies respawn. She is armless, I suppose. Seriously, there are a lot of broken locks in this apartment building. Obviously the super isn't doing his job. Oh boy, music! A television! There's nothing unusual about it. I felt the need to mention that. Though. This note? It must have been the person who lived here. So help me if the phone rings. Three needles stand of three different heights. The fat, the tall, and the thin. A fat needle? From slow to fast, they move to the right. Scott rests not on three, but fifteen. <sighs> That's kind of a twisted thing to just jot down in your journal and leave next to the phone. Scott rests on fifteen needles? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Scott a junkie? There's writing on the clock. The scars from the past shall remove the nail that stops time. This is definitely the place I want to be. Yeah, let's push that clock. Let's see what secrets lie beyond it. Huh? Stuck to the ground? Okay, so I'm gonna need a hammer. If I had a hammer. Come on, dude, you can push a clock. Oh, I gotta move the dials, I see. Oh, it's puzzle. The clock has stopped at 3.50 and 15 seconds. Faceplate is closed. It is locked. I can't touch the needles of the clock like this. So break the glass. Shoot the glass.
All right, all right, I get it. Just smash it. What's the problem? It seems like a like a no-brainer kind of thing. Right, I get that. All right, so let's dig into this. The scars from the past shall remove the nail that stops time. Okay. Scars from the past. Gotcha. I like how in Resident Evil they were just like, push these blocks into the right spaces. And this place is like, the scars that stop time. Three needles stand on three different heights. The fat, the tall, and the thin. Okay, so those are the ones from the clock. Right. From slow to fast, they move to the right. Scott rests not on three, but fifteen. So you're describing a clock. Now this song is stuck in my head. You're welcome. I'm just providing a service. Well, let's see what else is around here. There might be something I'm missing. <laughs> Swing on a women's night. Well, so much for that theory. I thought I saw a hammer earlier, but it would be really stupid to have to have a hammer when I have a giant stick. Is this the supers room? That's where I came in. Okay, well, let's see what's on the third floor. Something good, no doubt. One hour shout out. Thank you, Nicole. I, you know, it just occurs to me I haven't updated this. Uh, James, those games brought to you by Jack Moore, Triple Gate 8, Last Olympian, and Ever Sprite. Uh, I haven't checked if that is accurate, but uh, thank you all the same. <laughs> and everybody for your support. I appreciate it. What is this? Wooden plank. Well, this place seems friendly. There's a key on the ground on the other side of the bar. So if I stretch my arm out, I just might be able to reach it. Ah, oh, I saw this from the trailer for the remake. Let's see what happens. Use the stick. Ow! What are you, thick? Hey, wait! Damn it. These whippersnappers, use the stick in your hand. Just, golly. I like how she didn't even take the keys. She just kicks it away. Thanks a lot. Now this place is creepy. I'm not even sure if my brilliant sense of humor can defuse the situation. We'll see. Shopping cart. Nice. Shopping carts and handguns go hand in hand. This wall is pockmarked with gunshots. Cool. Can I open the door? No. All right. I'll stick to my trusty stick until I can't kill things with it anymore. Whoa. Is this going to be one of those deals where it's like, you got the gun. 
Here's some horrible creatures to kill you. Well, let's go back through here. I love how loudly he clomps. Yeah, I checked this one already. Oh, the laundry. Just a normal washing machine. There's nothing of interest. So why is it in the game? Ooh, trash chute. There's some kind of strange garbage stuck in the hole. Oh, so you're interested in this garbage, huh? Too good for the other garbage, but this is interesting for some reason. Okay. I don't know why that's necessary information. Was that a baby? Or a small man crying for help? Cool. Something to look forward to. Oh, the TV's on. Nice. You okay? I abhor violence in all its forms. Till that thing starts coming for me. Room 202? Okay. Who could have? Who would have? I'll come back to the. Go oh, wait, what's this? <laughs> what's this? <laughs> Henry Mildred Scott. Okay. Oh, it's hour, minute, second. All right, that's easy enough. Must have been a killer of a channel. <laughs> he was watching true crime TV and got too true for him. Big chicken. It'd be nice if I could actually read the numbers on the door, you know? Two oh two. I don't think they thought this through. Unless <laughs> Bob. course. Hmm. Uh. 
That is a window. I like that it gave you the subtitle for the names with the names clearly visible. Yeah, you know, it's just... That's some quality service right there. No! Come back. Becky! Alright, well, he's harmless. Just likes to crawl on the floor. Gets those zombie zoomies. The body of a dead butterfly is on the ground. There's nothing else of interest here. What's in here? Sounds like the machine in my work that folds pamphlets into three parts. It's a very specific reference that I think six people in the world would get. All right, health drain. Go back in the kachunk chunk room. It's too dark to tell for sure, but I think there's something on the other side of the hole. Oh? Ew! Put that away. <gasps> Killing for seconds, huh? You're a greedy boy, James. Oh, nice. Is this where something pops out of a door? I'm just waiting for it. So is the static zombie radio like angel radio on the show Supernatural? I uh, unfortunately am not familiar enough with Supernatural to weigh in on that. Angel radio sounds like some kind of like Christian adult contemporary radio station. <laughs> oh, this is where I was earlier. You now you know exactly what to do when the remake gets here. I know, I'm set. Clompa, clompa, clompa. Back to this fun place. Let's look at these scribbles on the wall again. You gonna make me uh, use the clock key? Is that how this works? Yes. I feel so used. Wow. Were those like heavy duty, like factory hinges that have been rusty for 40 years? <laughs> Sticking your arm in a hole doesn't seem like a good idea, especially in a dark, scary building. Yeah, there's a key in there. Yeah. All right, let's go look at that puzzle again, since I'm obviously just wasting time at this point.
All right, three needles stand at three different heights. The fat, the tall, and the thin. Slow to fast, they move to the right. From slow to fast, they move to the right. Scott rests not on three, but 15. Okay. I think I have an idea. And this one's. Yeah. No, don't push the clock. It's fine. <laughs> I think I've got this. I think the hour hand is at one, the minute is at two, and the second is at three. That's what I'm. guessing and it is just a guess wrong okay because they go from slow to fast like this Maybe? Oh wait, it's just showing me what direction they need to be pointed. I'm an idiot. Okay. That's all I needed to know right there. I was reading way too much into this puzzle. I just wanted to hear that sound again. 10 and two, let's try it. Did I not have that right? How exact does this need to be? It's like, <laughs> sketch this out. It seems like an escape room scenario. Maybe this game had an influence on modern escape rooms. Maybe. I do like that there's actually puzzles here. Though. Resident Evil's just like, you found a medallion. Put it in the thing, and the thing opens. This is an actual, like, I'll figure it out, boy. Oh, click. Okay. See, again, I'm reading too much into this. Oh, boy, clock room. If somebody went to the trouble to make this room, there must be something good in it. Yes, I was about to say, a safe room would be fantastic. All right, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. You guys enjoy this chair. <laughs> I don't know.
All right, I'm back. What a chair. <laughs> Left side of the chair for us lefties. <laughs> All right. Bop, bop, bop. Map. So happy to have a save room. Health drink. Woohoo, where'd the chair go? Man. Upstaged by my own chair. How many doors can we put in this room? How many you got? Now that's a camera angle. So that monster I saw earlier is in the same place as me. Maybe not. Hi, my name is James. I love line dancing. Let's go upstairs first. Hmm? What you got? What is it, boy? Bullets. Stairwell bullets. My favorite kind. Here we go. Nice and staticky for us. Ew, what did I just walk in on? Is this game rated M for mature? What the heck did I just witness? I'm sorry, sir. I should have knocked. I told you I was freaking. I told you it was freaking, baby. You didn't believe me. How much did you see? It was all consensual, all right? Don't judge me. Why don't you have any gaps in your fingers? Uh, James is a total creep. Really? <laughs> don't waste my bullets. I would never do that. Did that actually work? <laughs> what the heck? Was there a key in here that I saw? Yeah, courtyard key. Pyramid head, he's cool. Yeah, he was giving someone the business. <laughs> I walked in. Seems like a private gathering in more ways than one. I'm your private dancer, dancer for money, do what you want me to do. This isn't the time for a flight of the concourse. It's always time. Yeah. It's the only thing I could think that would adequately capture the essence of what just transpired. Seriously, this is the apartment building with no windows. Hey. Watch out. I'm gonna get you. 
Well, you can tell by the way I use my walk. Out! Stop it! Ah, stop it! What's my status? Do I need some drinkies? Did that help at all? Am I back where I started? I guess I must be. Oh yeah, that was the locked door from earlier. All right, all right. Come full circle. So this should be that new stairwell. Yeah, all right. So the pyramid head thing was just to get the courtyard key. What's in here? Oh, the other key. And the little girl. Wait. Oh, this is where I was earlier. I see. I forgot I was on the third floor that time. So confused. Which way was it? Let's just go downstairs. It's locked. Oh, great. Okay. Back away we go. Guess I wasn't done on the third floor. Yeah, that's what I remember about this game, is that it was uh, a lot of kind of back and forth looking for what you're supposed to do. Which was always fun. So this must be a new place. Hold on, let me check something real quick. Okay. Ah, this is where the key is. More normal washing machines. Bullets. Oh, you're getting sprayed, bro. <laughs> ah, stop it. Back here. Why even bother? I have a feeling the remake is going to be better. I also have a feeling most people were looking at this game with rose-tinted glasses. 
Okay. I know where I am now. As is often the case with 20-year-old games. I remember playing that when I was 17. Oh, it's... It was a long time ago. I mean to intrude on your business here. Seriously, he needs to invest in some sneakers. Get rid of those boots. That's right, I have to use the key. What? Now I'm very confused. Oh, I can turn the light on and off. Well... Uh, Jiminy Jillikers, I'm confused. Any hints, chat? Stairwell is different from the one I've been to. Perhaps. I wear boots for work every day, and I've accidentally snuck up on people while wearing them, so it's not always the footwear. Yeah, he's just a big clumpy idiot, I guess. Where's my wife? My dead wife wrote me a letter. Gotta find her. Be someone pranking you, bro. You for real? Ah, oh, yeah, this is where I started. Huh? Canned juice. Hmm. Got canned juice in my hand tonight, baby. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Maybe I can go somewhere else? Oh. What's unlocked? Where am I? What is going on? Just as lost, if not more. Good, it's not just me. Oh, cool. I was able to come out from that place I was at earlier. So what did that get me? Can I just go down the street? I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try to just go down the street. Even though I know that's not gonna work. Wait, what's over here? Oh, that was the garbage. So there's sex, there's definitely something with the garbage on the second floor. It's gonna pop out and come down here. Cause they wouldn't put this in the game if there was no purpose to it. How to get it to come down though. Am I dying or what? My controller is vibrating like I'm dying. Oh yeah, I am dying. Did that even do anything? Ah, 
<laughs> okay. I guess I'll look around this apartment some more. Something's not right. I'm tempted to just look it up. But I'm not gonna. is also broken. Okay. It doesn't help that there's two identical buildings here. Chill. Oh, I'm in the second building right now. I meant to go in the other one. Shoot. Thank you. Oh, wait, here. I'll, I'll keep that here. I can drink right. Got a refill. Refill the good stuff. <laughs> I'm just glad my apartment is not a complicated death trap like in this game. Yeah. I would not want to live here. For many reasons. Not least of which is the total lack of windows. Ah. That. in this room earlier? I guess not. Nope. First aid kit right there. And bullets. Toilet. Health drink. Wow. Bad room to miss. Check all of these first. Now. Stop that. Okay, and this one takes me back down to the stairwell. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I'm so confused. Let me go back to the second floor. So I have to go to the third floor and then go back down. This is the most horrifying thing about this game so far. Excuse me. Barf, barf. It's amazing how quickly you can become acclimated to zombies running up and throwing up on you. Okay, yeah, yeah, blah, blah, let's go. Okay, so this is the other stairwell. So there's three. This would be like the fire escape-y kind of place, yeah. Make double sure I can't get out through the door on the bottom. It'll be this one. No, oh, not the map. Not the map. Not the map. Not the map. All right. I can zoom it. Fire escape. Is this not the fire escape? There was a fire escape at the far west end of the second floor hallway. Maybe I can use it there. Well, there we go. Key to door which leads from the west side stairway hall to the courtyard. It says courtyard. Okay. Far west end of the second floor hallway. Okay. For Ryan, page five, what's up? Hi, I am 17, by the way, and I am a furry. All right. <laughs> okay. Welcome. <laughs> That's all I can say. Bit late with the drink fairy was invaded by a stealth kitty. A stealth kitty? Now this should be the hole in the wall. Yes. Okay. I like this music. Clearly I'm on the right track. Oh gosh. Maybe not. Which one's the west side hallway? This one? Let me check that garbage real quick. I'm just, I'm totally convinced that there's something there. There's something there. I don't know what. There's a trash chute. Some kind of strange garbage stuck in the hole. Okay. Ryan, I have this game. Me too. Um, excited for the remake. Maybe I'm just reading too much into it. Cat jumped through the night service hatch while I was serving a customer. <laughs> that's hilarious. I think that's a good problem to have at work. That's a good distraction. All right, let's get out of this place. Not much of a fire escape. 
<laughs> there is no fire escape outside the door. Maybe they knocked it down when they built the building next door. That sounds safe. I think I can get into the building next door if I go through the window in front of me. Sounds like a plan. Oh, it's open. Okay. I thought he was just going to go barreling through a window. Old broken down bed. Ew, gross. No wonder these apartment residents are so upset. This place is awful. Toilet's all backed up. Thank you. Ooh, a safe. I'm sure it's anything but. Um, I'm gonna look this up. <laughs> Oh, I see. I never would have found this out. I'm glad I checked. I'm glad I'm a dirty cheater. It looks like there's something stuck inside the toilet. <laughs> Will you take it out? Yes. Take it out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What is this, train spotting? Hmm. Looks like a wallet. There's some kind of memo in it. 16, 13, 14, 11. I'll write that down. Jonathan, what's up? That is horrifying. It's the scariest thing in this game so far, is this toilet. It looks like there's a lot of corn in it, so. You know, the residents were eating healthy. Where's that safe? Never played Silent Hill 2. It's treasure. Um, so, wait. I didn't look at the. Dang. I forgot that there's arrows and such. Wallet in toilet bowl. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay, so 16. 13. 16, and then 13. 14. Okay, so I start on 16. I guess. I don't know. This isn't the clearest way to explain a combination. That's okay. Obviously was not the way to do that. So sixteen. Oh, it was that easy? <laughs> Figured it was like a real combination lock where you gotta spin it a couple times. Oh whoa, got some bullets. Got a pocket full of shells. I will continue playing with my stick. Wait a minute. No. Scary music is scary. <laughs> yeah. How was he able to read that note at all? Oh. 
Oh. Oh, how am I supposed to get out the Christmas decorations? Looks promising. Ah! What the heck? No! Ah! Is that a cockroach? No! Oh. Leggy, 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 leggy. Hey. In trouble, y'all. Ah! Please don't scream at me. So the point of this place is... Liked it better on the second floor. Yeesh. This seems like my type of horror game. <laughs> what type is that? <laughs> it's just... It's just monsters made of legs. I came out. Oh, I was here. That's right. I came out of the toilet. Dear Tim, I have to run an errand, so I'm going out. I left the house key with Uncle David. You know where he lives, don't you? The key is in the room near the first floor staircase. I'll be back as soon as I can, so please watch the place while I'm gone. the laundry. Who's going to do the laundry if I'm murdered? Oh, shoot. Uh. Okay, what the heck? Maybe a dirty cheater again. Are these the Woodside Apartments? Ah, oh, shoot, there's a map in the other building. Ah, oh, man. That would have been handy. Shoot. All right, well, I guess that's what IGN is for. supposed to do okay the clock and then the third floor 307 start a cutscene courtyard key right 
The laundry room, now that you're on this side of the gate, you can pick up the fire escape. Got that. Handgun bullets. When you're done, head east into the hall and go through the door at the end. Take the stairs. Coin snake? What? This walkthrough is so not useful at all. I wish I'd picked up that map. Leggy. Might just go back and get it. I think it would make my life way easier. Wait, this is where the other monsters were. Here, you creepy bug. Come on, legs. <laughs> uncle's apartment please let it be oh praise be right at two hours too that's pretty fortuitous hallelujah hallelujah all right once again, thank you to Jack Moore Trippet Gate 8. Last time you never surprised for being sponsors of James Loves Games. Thank you to all the members as well. Thank you everybody for tuning in. Oh, you guys are the best. This is fun. Uh, I'm going to uh, probably continue to stream this one. I'm not sure what days. It's just going to kind of depend on how much energy I can muster at the end of the day. So uh, I don't know if it'll be Tuesday and Thursday, but uh, I'll try to make that happen. And I think this game is only like eight hours or so, so... Uh, I'm thinking like four or five streams, maybe. We'll see. Um, that was very good timing. It rarely works out that perfectly. But uh, Abhishek, hey, what's up? You just missed <laughs> the whole stream, but that's okay. Uh, let me go over to this. Hold on. Hold on. Stop that. No, I'm not ending it yet. I just want to say uh, thanks again for tuning in. You guys are the best. I'll be playing uh, through Silent Hill 2 for the next couple of weeks. And uh, I've got another video coming out, hopefully in the next week or two, for my uh, the games I played in 2022 ranked. So the uh, 15, number 15 to number one. I'll have that out soon as well. Uh, but yeah, you guys, uh, you guys are awesome. So keep your eyes peeled. I'll have more stuff coming soon. And uh, yeah. I'll see you next time right here on... There we go. That's better. Bye.